Hey everyone, I wanted to provide a quick description of the first project. So I'm in Oaks, click on assignment sheet, there it is. Um, you just finished uh, what I'm calling a project-based short form assignment. In every case, those project-based assignments will be in preparation for a major project. So in that project-based assignment, you discussed a meaningful writing experience or a memorable writing experience. What you're doing in this project is developing that writing experience into a rhetorical analysis. Um, so in the syllabus, uh, you, if you, when you read through the syllabus, you notice this part. Uh, think back, what's the most memorable piece of writing that you've ever done? I skimmed through those posts. I'll provide extensive feedback tomorrow. But I skimmed through those posts, and there were some nice examples of those memorable writing experiences. In this project, you're going to document that memorable writing, that memorable piece of writing, and then think through how the rhetorical situation that you responded to shaped that piece of writing. So this comes in four or five pages. Your task is to reflect on how your writing experience was the result of the situation it was related to. Um, as is the case, uh, as was the case with the discussion board, the piece that you select is up to you. Um, it could be in school or out of school. It could be school related, like a scholarship letter, an admittance letter, um, application for an internship. Just make sure it was written in response to a rhetorical situation. I provided five things here uh, that your analysis should do. I need a definition of rhetorical situation. You've already developed those in a discussion board. Make sure you refer to uh, a reading. Um, so that might be a summary, a paraphrase, or a quotation. Provide, uh, using, using example text, find me a, a definition of the rhetorical situation, and particularly the constituent parts, exigence, audience, constraints. You'll want to give a short description of the piece you wrote. Um, it could be a summary of the content. Um, enough to kind of uh, give enough background information to know what you're talking about. Then I need a description of the rhetorical situation you were addressing. What was the exigence you were trying to resolve? Who was the audience for your piece of writing? What constraints were involved in the piece of writing? And then the bulk of the paper will be this fourth point outlining how your writing experience was shaped by the rhetorical situation, by the exigence, which may have given you purpose or focus, by the audience, uh, which, may, uh, which may have created stress or, or excitement or something the like. And then uh, the fifth point is kind of optional. Uh, provide any other relevant details about your writing experience, how you felt, uh, who helped, uh, how you felt about the piece once it was completed, uh, these are just some particulars. Uh, it needs to be MLA formatted with headers, margins, page numbers, and font. Um, I need you to cite the sources you used to uh, define the rhetorical situation. Since the writing experience you're recounting probably didn't result in a published piece of writing, it was unpublished, I don't, I don't need citations of the piece you're analyzing. And then give it to me in Oaks and Doc or DocX. This just makes uh, feedback easier. Um, okay, that's my short description. Please email if you have any questions. Thanks very much.